My name is Marisol and I like to volunteer in the neighborhood because growing up in this neighborhood I saw a lot of injustice. So we're using Google Maps to educate people in the community and outside of the community to let them know our industry sites. This is a tool for organizing and for you to tell people that you know, hey, this is happening, let's do something about it. I can basically just put any video or any media onto the map and show people all over the nation what's going on in Little Village. My name is Junior Walk. I was born and raised in southern West Virginia and I'm working on, you know, fighting the coal industry and fighting strip mining in, in Appalachia. I'd known Judy Bonds ever since I was a little baby. She's one of the people who helped start Coal River Mountain Watch. I came here to the office and talked to Judy and asked her what I could do to help out and she told me to start writing for the newsletter. My name is Jessie Ruth Corkins. I helped found the Vermont Sustainable Heating Initiative. The Vermont Sustainable Heating Initiative started as a grassroots movement. We're trying to help low-income families transition from heating uh, with expensive petroleum-based heating fuels to low-cost pellet heating. My name is Anelisa Perez Quintero and I live and work in Puerto Rico. Gaia is Grupos Ambientales Interdisciplinarios Aliados. It's basically an organization of organizations. We look at a problem that we're worried about as a community and then we tackle it through different ways. We actually have four programs, the research program, the education program. We do that research and we do that education, then we go out and try to implement it. My name is Phoebe Myers and I co-founded Change the World Kids. We are a nonprofit organization set out doing both international humanitarian and environmental efforts. My name is Mizra Walker, I'm 18 years old and I live in Hunts Point in the South Bronx section of New York City. When I was in second grade, um, I went to this community center called the Point CDC and they did a lot of activism work in the community and that kind of sparked my interest in environmental activism. We're a teen youth activist group, high school age students, and we work on environmental and social campaigns.